the greatest goalkeepers in the world. But none of them, and in fact no other keeper in the whole of Europe, has kept more clean sheets in the league this season than Shrewsbury Town's Jason Lutweiler. He's 25 years old, six foot four inches tall, an ex-Switzerland under 21 international, and his super shot stopping has catapulted Shrewsbury to the top of League Two. He's kept 16 clean sheets in the league this season. To put that into perspective, Thibaut Courtois at Chelsea has kept eight. So in other words, Jason Lutweiler is Mr. Unbeatable. And better still, he doesn't even know it. Now a quick quiz question for you first. Do you know which keeper has got the most clean sheets in the whole of Europe in the league this season? Oh, that's a very good question. Uh, I will probably say it's probably one of the top clubs, like maybe Barcelona. The keeper with the most clean sheets in the league this season in the whole of Europe is yourself. Very good. <laughs> I take that for me. It's lovely. I didn't know that. Uh, they're playing on very high, high level. And uh, I mean, we play on League Two is a very good level as well, but it's very different. And uh, the quality of the player on the top league is, uh, is the difference is massive. Everybody wants to know your special secret for keeping so many clean sheets. What is it? My secret is very simple. A very good communication with my defence. You need your four back, or back, three or back defenders to do that and you need the whole team as well. Now I've seen you in action quite a few times this season and I, I know you like to punch the ball from crosses, mm -hmm. which is a very European style of goalkeeping. Mm -hmm. the English keepers maybe prefer to catch the ball. Maybe. Why, why do you think there is that difference between European and English goalkeepers? Uh, I think the big difference is like, uh, as European, uh, it's not that physical. And uh, when you come over to England, you feel that the striker is going to come all the time against you. So uh, sometimes I have to catch it, so I do it. But uh, I like to punch it because I know the danger is out and uh, the ball goes wide and we can, can be back uh, with the team and the defence. Taking you back to when you were a young 12-year-old goalkeeper mm -hmm. in, in Switzerland, mm -hmm. playing in your back garden, mm -hmm. which goalkeepers did you pretend to be? Uh, van der Sar. Van der Sar. Yeah, he was very big as well. Yeah, he was my, my hero. So Van der Sar was your hero growing up. Which keepers now? Do you, do you admire and look up uh, to? To be fair, I like De Gea. He got a lot of critics when he came back. I come from some Spain and uh, I'm coming from another country and I know you need time to, to, to get in a new country, the language and everything. And I think there was very hard with him, but now we show them that he's very good and maybe one of the best now in the world as well. I've always wanted to ask a keeper this. Do your gloves smell? No, not really, to be fair. You want to try Because every it? pair of Goldie gloves I had as a kid, Absolutely honked. Yeah, it's a big mistake though. You have to hang it up on a, like uh, anywhere, like uh, for example on the shower, some like that, so they dry and uh, uh, during the night and the, the, the sweating go out. So that's that was my, my mistake. Yeah, exactly. So the Shrews are sitting pretty at the top of the table and they face relegation threat and Tranmere away this afternoon. But judging by the man they've got in sticks, their title charge is very much in safe hands.